Hey folks, here is a short tutorial. Since the release of Media Composer 2024, there is now not only the possibility to search the bins with the so-called bin map that has been around since 2019, but now this function also exists for the timeline, the so-called sequence map. We all know the problem within complex projects. There are lots of video and audio tracks and it's often difficult to keep up. The Composer window is usually above the timeline. Depending on the size of the screen and the resolution, you find your compromise between the timeline and the Composer, simply by adjusting the size of the individual window. So you don't want to scroll around too much in the timeline and you don't want to reduce the tracks too much. It depends on the specific project. But now there is a completely new way, without having to touch your timeline at all. You can use a kind of mini timeline, which is called the sequence map. But where is it? Unfortunately, it is somewhat hidden and cannot be found in the fast menu like the bin map, but the map is set up as a right click. It is a function rather than a conventional command. Once called up and you can enjoy this flexible way of working. If however the function is no longer required, one click in the real timeline is enough and the sequence map disappears. This method is also in the timeline menu item and can be placed on the keyboard. This provides quick control on the push of a button. I hope that will help you with your timeline work. Until next time.